What if I tell you that you can transform your WordPress website speed, user experience and SEO within just 5 minutes? Whether you run an e-commerce store, a personal blog, portfolio website or your company website, this video is very simple but very important for your website rankings and user experience. So initially when you don't have many backlinks and your domain authority is low, you cannot control all these factors very quickly. But one thing you can really control which is your website speed. And this is already proven that fast website with less backlinks ranks much better with slow website with less backlinks. And it is very obvious that fast website provides a good user experience. So today we're going to do all these things using this one simple free plugin which is called Optimal plugin. You can see it's trusted by 200,000 plus users. It was updated three days ago. Guys, it's really important to know quality of a plugin. If it is updated frequently, that's a reliable plugin. Not just this, you can see they got 4.7 star rating out of 5 star rating. And let me tell you very quickly why I'm recommending this plugin. Because it compressed images we've got quality loss. They have this machine learning power technology which preserves the details. They have global AWS CloudFront CDS which serve your images from 450 plus location. And guys, this is really important. If you run a website for one country and you're targeting other country, global CDN is really important. And when you have this kind of free CDN, your website loads very fast in all the countries. WebP and AVF conversion, which can save you 80% of file sizes. Complete image offloading, this feature available on Pro version, but today we're talking only about free version. jQuery free lazy loading, because what happens sometimes, some plugin they use jQuery to lazy load the images, but it might come with a lot of errors, so your website might break. So this is a really nice plugin which will help you to lazy load images without jQuery. And it also improves Core Web Vitals significantly. Adaptive image sizing, which perfectly fit for every device. Cloud media library, support for all file type. Automatic watermarking, guys. This is really, really important nowadays. So you can protect your visual content. It automatically add a watermark on your images so people cannot steal it. Even they steal it, they use it. They will see it's your image. It's coming from your website. I will show you the correct and proper installation of this plugin. And they're really good free plan for the site which have 200,000 visits per month. Even also, I'll show you later how you can get 25,000 visits per month. So it's not just how many times people are visiting, it's about visitors. So for example, I visit the website multiple times a day. So that's going to be one visit. And the best part is all this will happen automatically. Just install once and forget about it. And today, I'll show you the correct and proper installation of this plugin. So your website will rank faster, you have better user experience, and also you have better SEO rankings because of a fast website. Okay, so let's go to my computer screen. But before, very quickly, I want to tell you that if you're serious about your website ranking and traffic, I highly, highly recommend you to subscribe to my channel because I teach AI power techniques and the right use of AI, which will definitely give you results. You will have better rankings and you have more traffic on your website. And subscribing is totally free. It just takes two seconds. I would really appreciate that. And that's also a nice way to support the channel. With this said, let's go to my computer screen and install Optimal plugin and take your website to the next level. So log into WordPress website and then click on add plugins. And there, from here, you can just search Optimal, there's a free plugin available in WordPress repository. If you want to download the pro plugin, you can find the link in the description. Even for free plugin, I will add a lot of useful information. So please check the description of this video. So you see the first plugin, you can see, click on install now. Once it's installed, click on activate. Okay, now you will present in this screen here. You will see here, not connected. And what I really like about this plugin, the process of installation is really simple. We just install the plugin, now just enter your email ID here. Click on create and connect account, that's it. It will automatically add the API key for you to use this plugin. It's that simple. You can see within just few seconds, we have the plugin setup. We have the API key here. Do not share this API key with anybody else. You can see the main dashboard of this plugin, which will tell you what are you using here, all the information about your website and also possible issue. We'll cover everything one by one. So you can see I already have this plugin installed on my website. So it's already saved me 8.5 MB of size, which is really great results. And you can see I have 90.35% average reduction of my website images. And you can see the optimization status here. In your case, you might have this option disabled, but I will tell you step by step how we can make the best use of this plugin. So for example, if you click here on possible issues, you might see this issue here. For example, Lightspeed Cache has lazy loading enabled. So in this case, what you need to do is you need to go to Lightspeed Cache plugin and then disable your lazy loading. And also if you're using any other optimization plugin for images, please disable that plugin. This plugin is really good plugin. It can handle all kind of optimization about images. And if you're facing conflicts with any other optimization plugin, please check the description. I'll add some resources for you to help you out. So now the main thing here is settings. So click on settings here. It's really important. So first of all, general, you have enable optimal image handling. 
keep it on and then this is the point here if you just click here in this option you have this banner which says that optimize by optimal and then you have 20,000 plus more visits on your website and you can also enable show only optimal icon so for example if I enable this I click on save changes now if I go back to my website you can see I have this really tiny logo here and also it shows people that I'm serious about my website I'm using a CDN I'm using a optimized servers to give better user experience to my people so I don't see any problem if you want to use this logo here I don't know sometimes why people they want to hide these kind of things it's totally fine if you are using free resources so if you're a beginner or you're on a budget it's totally fine to show these kind of logos on your website sometimes I see people they want to hide which plugin they're using if there was a free plugin or what theme here they're using but I think it's totally fine if you show that you see a word website speed and then you're taking action using a nice plugin and you can also set the location from left to right in case you're using that location for displaying cookie banner okay now let's talk about internal storage you do not need to do anything here just keep it option like this optimal cloud in, on your website and the important thing what you need to focus here is advanced click on advanced and then you have this option so first is watermark so for example you can click on open optimal dashboard now you will see you're logged in inside your optimal account if you cannot log in directly by clicking here just you can use the forget password and you can reset the password once you're logged in inside here you can see here watermark so click on watermark here and then this is very interesting feature you can click on add watermark and you can add any image here for example let's take one image just to show you guys I will add my own image here and then click on upload and from here if you click on rules from here then click on add rules and then select the condition for example I select a site and this is my domain and then I click on next so now you can see no watermark selected if I select this watermark image I selected then I can make the opacity very less so it's not on all the image and then scaling I make it very small so for example if anybody steal an image from a website you can see this my watermark will be always be visible here and you can choose the location from where you want this to be shown for example if I do a center it will always be shown on the center then click on save let's go back to WordPress dashboard so second thing is compression so compression speed optimize is very important if you want to keep it like this which prioritize faster loading on smaller images by applying balanced level of lossy compression or you can also choose quality optimize if you think that quality of image is very important for you you can choose quality optimize and click on save changes after quality optimize you have this option custom from here you see multiple options you can see here automatic best image format selection so if this option is enabled Optimal will decide whether to use AVI format or WebP format to keep them visually sharp and load pages fast. And retina quality is for Apple devices to show the sharp images. Network based optimization, you do not need to really enable this option. You can try it, but in some cases, it might show blurry images. Then you have other options regarding search, CSS, and JS through Optimal. And then strip image metadata and auto quality powered by machine learning by default you do not need to touch any option on this page you can just keep it quality optimized and again let's talk about resizing so this is very important feature so now here you have this feature smart cropping which is a very useful feature so when it is enabled by optimal it automatically detects the most interesting part of images for example you can see here if this is your image it is cropped in normal cropping it will be like this but with smart cropping the most interesting part of your image will be shown here but again please make sure if you want to do this or not because that's just a add-on it's not something which should really affect the user experience but this is a really interesting add-on and please make sure that you really want this feature because this is just a add-on it's totally depend on you to use it or not to use it I've shown you because this exists and for some website it can be really interesting limit image size so this is really really important because what happens sometimes we download a stock images and for example if I see this image the image size is really really huge image size if anybody download it the original image will be 6000 pixels wide which is a huge image so what optimal does it will automatically adjust the image size and the maximum size will be 920 to 4000 and this is like very standard size you can leave it just like this or if you want to add a custom crop size you can also add the crop size here now here we comes about lazy load which is very important and also really help your website and also people who face issue with breaking the website and also LCP of the website with the largest contentful paint so let me tell you largest contentful paint then we can talk about lazy load this is my website you can see this is a big image here this is the largest content showing on my first viewport and it's really important this image does not lazy load this is very very important 
rest all these images on my page you can see these could be lazy load which are lazy loading but the first image should not be lazy load so what mistake people does using any image optimization plugin they optimize and lazy load all the images no you need to optimize the image but do not lazy load the first image at least first couple of images which are showing on the first report and this is why i like optimal because they make things very easy for you guys with their simple options so make sure keep here smart loading checked and then from here make sure loading method global and skip lazy load for first two images or you can also keep three images if your lcp is coming on the third image let it be like this make sure this option is not unchecked and also skip images above the fold what it does all the images above the fold these images will not be lazy loaded and that's what we need is really important that do not lazy load the lcp images if you want to watch the complete view on lcp check the link in description and then we have visual setting enable generic placeholder and then enable no script fallback enable this option and then smart image scaling please make sure these option also enabled and then click on save changes guys this was all option mostly you will require ever you might not need any more option it was super simple setup then one very important thing you might need click here on exclusions for example there is a image certain image which is not loading properly on the site or you don't want to be lazy loaded or you don't want to be optimized you can just what you can do you can choose the image file name here and add the image name here for example this image i just open this image in new tab and then i will copy this image name from here and then i'll just add this image name here I click on add filter so now this image will be excluded from the optimization and also very important you have don't lazy load image if and then you can give the file name here also you can have all rules like image extension if the image is png or jpg you can add those extension here even for page url for example if i go to my website and this is a cart url i don't want to lazy load any image on my website on this url so what i'll do i'll copy this url and then i will add the page url here so any image on this page will not be lazy loaded so if you don't want to optimize and lazy load images both the cases you use this option but if you just want to exclude from lazy loading you add the image url here or page url here or any rule which is suitable for your requirement and guys you can always log in into optimal dashboard and you can see i am on free plus we have 2000 visits shown here but because i'm using the optimal logo on my website so i get 25000 visits but if you want you can also opt for start in business plan if you have business website you can spend money it's a real nice plugin you can find the link in description to get the best plan for optimal so guys you see it was so simple to install this plugin it will definitely improve website speed optimize images improve user experience and also improve the seo because your website is fast so if you're serious about your website speed user experience and seo try optimal today it will automate the process of image optimization and link in description to download the optimal plugin and more information about optimal plugin will be in description and please don't forget to like the video if this was helpful and don't forget to subscribe to the channel it just take 2 seconds and it's also a real nice way to show your support towards the channel and if you really want to know about lcp how we can optimize it please check this video on screen